July 11th, where we're looking. If you were in need of, let's say, curtain rods, where would you go? Possibly a home goods or hardware store, right? That would make the most sense. If you wandered into a bank asking for this item, you would probably receive some skeptical looks. You're in the wrong place for what you're seeking. You can't go to a computer repair shop and order a cheeseburger. <laughs> well, you could. You won't get it, first of all. And you might end up in a straitjacket and still hungry. Because looking in the right place for something is imperative to actually finding it. And it's no different when it comes to the emotional and spiritual fulfillment we need in life. Garth knows that. He learned it the hard way. But he's here to share with us his true story on this Unshackled Daily Devotional. Mom and Dad were alcoholics who abandoned us at various times and fought when they were together. When they finally split up, I lived with Mom on a farm where hard work became a habit. As soon as I learned to drive, I would go get Mom from the tavern so she wouldn't be driving home drunk. Finally, at 15, I ran away to live with my sister and her husband. I stayed with them as a real family until I graduated. Then I worked three jobs to save money to go to Europe. I was using drugs by then, acid, hash, cocaine. I had a lot of questions about life and thought travel would provide the answers. But people in Europe were as confused as I was. After several months, homesickness brought me back. Once again, I worked hard and hung out in pretentious bars where I met a girl and I got to know her parents. They were so different, quietly peaceful yet confident. Her mother spent some time one day talking to me about Jesus, about sin and my need to trust his death on the cross as payment for my sin. She explained the plan of salvation so well that I prayed with her to receive Christ as Savior. Neither traveling nor drugs could ease the longing in my soul, but Jesus did. He gave me a peace that passes understanding, and the Lord has a plan for my life that is still unfolding. Don't waste your time as I did in a futile search for things that don't satisfy. The prophet David says in Psalm chapter 34, verse 10, The young lions do lack and suffer hunger, but they that seek the Lord shall not want any good thing. Friend, in this world, we're bombarded by distractions, lifestyles, possessions, and achievements that we want to believe can provide for our deepest needs. But are we looking in the right place? Even as Christians, we're susceptible to worldly attractions. But we mustn't forget that Jesus is not only our rescuer, he's the answer to our every need. And we'll only find our satisfaction by seeking him above all else. Will you receive this truth today? Unshackled, the longest running audio drama in history airs on over 3,000 radio stations worldwide. Real people, real life stories, stirring dramatic accounts of hopelessness and the hope that changes everything. This award-winning program grips the heart with compelling and relevant stories of transformed lives. Without Jesus Christ, we are all shackled by sin, by our wrong choices, disobedience, and selfish motives. But God is at work, and the power of Christ sets us free of our bondage. We are unshackled. Listen to a new devotional every day, and don't forget to tell your friends about Unshackled Daily Devotionals.